There's a distinct hum on Lee Drive in Southington, which is music to the ears of David Rothenberg. The ones that, that are more likely to fly away are males. They're probably singing. The 50-year-old native of Westport is not a scientist. 96 hours they could be doing this. He's an artist. Wee, 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 wee. Who came to hum along with cicadas. has the mixture of noise and tone that they have. Rothenberg jams with New Age or belts out notes <laughs> that are more old school. 17 years is a long time to wait to compose with cicadas. Kind of between E and F. If you think it all sounds the same, with the bug that is, Rothenberg would say you're not listening closely. He believes he's isolated a wide range of melodies. Rothenberg has played with other insects, like crickets, which are more interested in rhythm. But cicadas may be the most fascinating. Their whole life cycle is to sing, fly, mate, and die. Rothenberg is still learning what notes and what instruments cicadas respond to most. He says it's just a privilege to share the stage, even one covered in poison ivy, with creatures born to sing. It's very humbling to play amidst million, a million musicians and try and make some impact. In Southington, John Charlton... Fox, Connecticut.